Every now and then, an update for the Google Play Store application is released that causes errors to pop up on various smartphones and tablets. These bugs can result in a variety of issues, including force crashes, being unable to update individual applications, and even stopping you from viewing the contents of the Play Store entirely. I've been seeing reports of people getting an error recently in the Google Play Store application that reads, something went wrong, and then asking you to try again. And no matter how many times people tap the try again button, they still get the something went wrong error. The first report I saw of this was in the Google Pixel subreddit. But when looking through Google's issue tracker for Android, I'm also seeing people getting this error when using the Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra, the Galaxy Note 10, the Redmi Note 12 Pro, and many, many other devices. While I can't offer a permanent solution to fix this issue, since it's actually a bug within the version of the Google Play Store that you have installed, I am able to show you a workaround that has been proven to work temporarily. The goal here is to downgrade the Google Play Store application to an older version. And we can do this by finding the icon for the Play Store application, whether that is in the home screen itself or down here in the application drawer and then performing a long press gesture on that application icon. You should now see a little eye icon appear in the menu that pops up. So let's tap that and it should take us to the app info page for the Google Play Store application. Now, if we look at the top right corner of the screen, you should see a three dot menu icon. Let's tap that. And you should see an option in the drop down menu labeled uninstall updates. Since the current version of the Google Play Store application that you have installed is bugged, and that is what is causing the issue telling you that something went wrong, we can work around this bug by uninstalling the updates that we have on our device. So let's tap the uninstall updates option and then confirm that we want to replace this app with the factory version. This essentially downgrades the version of the Google Play Store app that we have installed and gives us an older version that does not have the bug present in the code. I did mention that this is only a workaround because the Google Play application will update itself periodically. So whenever that update is downloaded and installed again, which is done automatically in the background, you are likely to get hit with this error again. Thankfully though, if that happens, we can go through this entire process all over again to uninstall the updates and get rid of that bugged version. And once that's done, we can open up the Google Play Store application and it should load like normal. Right now, our only way to get around this error is to continue using this workaround until Google ends up pushing out an update that fixes this bug. I have read that the issue seems to be fixed for some people, but even as of this morning, I'm seeing others talk about continuing to get this error. As with most updates released by Google, it is likely being slowly rolled out and will take a week or two until it reaches 100% availability. But thankfully, we shouldn't lose any functionality in the Google Play Store 
by uninstalling the updates. And this workaround should work long enough to install apps and games, while also giving you plenty of time to keep your third-party applications up to date.